Hello and welcome to GANMED. In this video, we will learn and understand how to calculate KPIs, quick quick up KPIs in within a fraction of minutes and uh, submit the report to our top management. Now, it's a bit of mid of month and suddenly your uh, boss calls and you tell you that you uh, calculate the KPI up to now and let me know. So you can use this tool called pivot ta table very effectively to uh, you know calculate your KPIs. Now, basically, the three KPIs what we generally calculate in industry is one is MTBF, MTTR, availability. Now, <coughs> let us understand what MTBF is. MTBF is basically mean time between two failures. Now, this is one failure. This is second failure. The machine starts from here. So, if this two between these two failures, machine stops here and then we start here and then again it stops here. So, between these two failures, what is the time, average time, is what is the MTBF. So uh, basically, it should be more higher the MTBF, more your performance is. And what it indicates basically are how well your preventive maintenance is, how well your condition based maintenance is, how well your predictive maintenance is, how well you are doing autonomous maintenance. And how you calculate it is, it is nothing but, you know, you have to uh, calculate the overall total time available, working time minus breakdown time divided by number of breakdowns. So this uh, you can calculate uh, with pure table. I'll show you that demo also. Next, what is MTTR? MTTR is mean time to repair. If a breakdown has come, how much time it takes, average time you take to repair, uh, again bring down, um, up, up, uh, up your machine. Uh, what it indicates basically, it's uh, knowledge management, how good your knowledge management is, how good your skill management is, how good your spare management is. And how it is calculated is, uh, total maintenance time divided by number of repairs. Then availability, this is, uh, this indicates overall, uh, you know, how, uh, how overall your maintenance is, how good your risk-based thinking is, what proactive actions you take. The higher the percentage, the better it, uh, your MT, uh, availability, uh, better your system is. So higher percentage availability is better the system. How you calculate is total time available minus breakdown time divided by total uh, available time. Generally, in industry, it should be more than 97%. Very important. Uh, more than 97%, 97, 98, 99 is what is uh, ex expected. If it is below this, your overall maintenance is not good. <coughs> now, uh, we'll also go to, uh, and we'll see this, uh, how to calculate quickly uh, using pivot uh, table, uh, your empty with your KPIs. But before that, uh, actually, what a pivot table is, Pivot table is a powerful tool uh, to calculate, summarize, and analyze data let's, that lets you to compar uh, com uh, see comparison patterns and trend in your data. So you can see all those things, but we will use pivot table to you know summarize the data and then uh, do a further calculation, right? So that's how uh, we are going to do. Uh, I'll show you this quick demo. Uh, we'll see you in the next uh, next side of the video. Thank you. <coughs> Okay, uh, welcome to this site. Uh, now uh, we'll calculate uh, MTP MTDR. This is a live demo for calculating MTP MTDR using pivot table. Now this is the data. Now if you see the total count of data is around 154 data. So if you want to, uh, you know, um, do short and uh, find out, it, it will take some time. So what we can do is to calculate MTP MTDR. You have to just select Control A, can select all data, put Insert, go to Insert put pivot table, put it in texture sheet. So you get the next sheet will open. Now here you have to just select the machine. So all machine will appear here and breakdown time. So breakdown time, uh, breakdown count will come. So here if you see this is count. So we have to check, convert this into one. Uh, we, have, we want hours also. So you go to field value and sum. So now you have got the data. Uh, num you have got the number of breakdown and you have got an hour of uh, minutes of breakdown. Now you have to just select this data and paste special as a value, right? So you have got the data. Now this is nothing but this is number of breakdown and this is minutes of breakdown, right? You got your data. Uh, now available hour is uh, this is 50, this, suppose this is 15 minutes 15 days data so simple 15 machine runs continuously 15 into 24 so you got available into uh, this is minute also so you have to add minutes 60 
right so now you have to calculate mtpf empty data mtpf mttr and availability so mtpf is what this minus break down our the diameters to add by we got the empty view. right empty tr is breakdown minus number of breakdowns availability is available hour available minute minus breakdown hour divided by bits this is what you are saying this is what you are saying now you got you, you saw how fast it is to use pivot table and generate your report so uh, use pivot table to generate your reports and uh, uh, be very fast to uh, also you can use this report to you know view sir analyze your data uh, where we are right now right thank you and uh, see you in next video